Victor Rosenberg yesterday on the heels of the Grammys. Obviously, Kanye stole a lot of the steam that the Grammys had. It was a great show, great performances. Beyonce did her thing. Even though some people said they would have liked to see Lettucey do that song, but we know what that is. Common John Legend, Rihanna, Kanye West, Paul McCartney. It was a lot of great things. Right. But Beck wins Album of the Year. Yes. I predicted on E that I was sure Beyonce would win Album of the Year. I was very surprised because I didn't like the Beck album, to be honest with you. Kanye acted like he was going to go up on stage and Taylor Swift Beck. Right. People laughed. Kanye did not. That was it. That was it. I thought that was cool. I thought that was cool. I like that. But then after the show, Kanye's up there with Chloe, Christina Milian, and Kim Kardashian and goes on a rant with regard to how he feels about the Grammys. Can you bring that up, Shiny Culture, please? The audio of Kanye the going Anye in? Of Con the audio of Kanye going in on his rant. The Anye of Kanye. Yeah, the Anye of Anye Kanye. Anye of Kanye. That sums it up very, very well. We've seen this story before. And also, Ebro, give props to Terrence J, who was also standing there with Give it up, West. Terrence J. Yeah, yeah, what was the young up, lady's big name? Up, big up, big up. You don't even know, right? Doesn't matter. Okay. Oh, Carissa? Yeah. Yes, of course. Okay. All right. Well, you have to put. Do, do you want to give up on this, Ebro? You want to keep trying to fight for the audio? Hey, so Beck was nominated twice before and didn't win, right? Yes, absolutely. But we'll get to that. I'm going to get right. to explain the Beck part. But the, the thing is, it's, it's about Kanye and the level of. You'll hear. Go, Kanye, go ahead. I just know that the Grammys, if they want real artists to keep coming back, they need to stop playing with us. We ain't going to play with them no more. Bow Flawless down. Beyonce video. And Beck needs to respect artistry, and he should have given his award to Beyonce. And at this point, we tired of it. Because what happens is, when you keep on diminishing art and not respecting the craft and smacking people in the face after they deliver monumental feats in music, you're disrespectful to inspiration. And we as musicians have to inspire people who go to work every day and they listen to that Beyonce album and they feel like it takes them to another place. Then they do this whole promotional event that, you know, they'll run, they'll, they'll run the music over somebody's speech to artists because they want a commercial advertising. Like, yeah. no, we not playing with them no more. And by the way, I got my wife, I got my daughter, and I got my clothing line, so I'm not going to do nothing to put my daughter at risk. Right. What? But I yes. am here to fight for creativity. That's the reason why I didn't say anything tonight. But y'all know what it meant when Ye walked on that stage. I need you to, I need you to fight for creativity. Remember my talk with you? I said I miss the Hennessy Ye. Out of here. Shut up. Stop it. That makes Chloe, that was Chloe talking. Chloe, you miss when Ye was with Amber? Drunk? Oh, that's been said. That's Anyways, so wild. Um, here's my issue with Kanye West, okay? With, I love Ye. I, I love that he performed. I love that he did with... We know, oh, we know, we he's, know. He's we Kanye. Know. He's our guy. He's family. We love Kanye. <clears throat> Do not talk about them stifling creativity as you take a big old dump on someone else's creativity. Kanye West didn't need to go at Beck. He didn't. He could have expressed how he felt about Beyonce, although I don't understand why Beyonce, of all people, needs defending. If you're keeping track, she won Grammys number 18, 19, and 20 on Sunday. She's one of the most celebrated artists of our time, okay? He's acting like she's Ava DuVernay and not getting the props that she deserves. You know what I'm saying? So that part I don't understand, but also Kanye, keep in mind, you and Beck are the same, bro. Beck is a weird dude who in the early 90s started doing different things that no one expected from a white alternative artist oh, to do. And combining sure. hip-hop yes. and alternative. He helped like Kanye West. Fast forward to Yeezus all these years later blurring lines. Y'all are the same. Why are you taking a dump on him to get across your message? My man, it was ill promo. You, you ruled the Grammys. We give you credit. But don't try to make it sound like it was some incredibly political feat. I don't think it was that. Thank <laughs> you.